Uh, hi folks, me and Kelly, we're going for a ride. We stopped here because we had a Groupon for the cremation. We got $200 off of cremation, but we didn't really really realize what it was, so <laughs> I didn't know you had to be dead first to get the Groupon, so we're kind of upset about that, but anyway, Bummer. we're going for a ride and you guys are coming with us. All right, so we're back in my favorite helo pad. Kelly got me a gorilla pod for a gift, so we're trying it out. And I couldn't think of a better way to do it than to do some donuts on the helo pad <laughs> with my new gorilla pod recording us. Yay! Oh, I'm about to lose my sunglasses. Fail. Wave at the camera when we go by. Hi! <laughs> we are extreme dorks and people <laughs> are seeing this because it's not dark like you usually do. Hi! <laughs> oh, I love my gorilla pod. Thank you, Kelly. You're very welcome, babe. <laughs> you and your gadgets Hi. and your and toys and you're acting like you're four. <laughs> Pageant wave. <laughs> so I really like it. Now I can uh, vlog like Casey Neistat. Hi, people. Hi. Hi, Pageant Wave. Hello. <laughs> my boyfriend is a dork. Thanks for my gift kiss. Dead inside. Don't open. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I guess the zombies are still here. Sweet. All right. Let's get rolling with some air. I talked to a guy that works here. Yeah. A, a client of mine who works there. That's at Rui's Food. Yeah. They make Mexican yeah. food. food. Yeah. Fro frozen Mexican stuff. <laughs> I said, how many burritos do y'all make a night? He said about 400,000. Wow. I was like, oh my gosh, 400,000 frozen burritos every night, seven nights a week, 365 days a year. That's a lot of frozen kind of icky burritos. <laughs> that is a ton of horrible burritos. It's crazy sometimes. I mean, I, I can't even comprehend the amount of tortillas they need every night, the amount of beef and stuff they need <laughs> every night. Beef and quotation marks. Yeah, maybe I'm overusing the word beef there, but... But the constituted beef-flavored paste. Yes, but still, yes. they need a lot of that paste. Yes. Even just to make the burritos, they need 400,000 tortillas every night. Right, that's a lot. So somewhere there's a factory that makes at least 400,000 tortillas every night. At least. <laughs> This is terrifying. <gasps> <laughs> so this is what's terrifying. This is the floodgates open. And they're not even open full way. This is not terrifying. So this is where I was when I recorded the damn terrifying video. And all the water was just pouring over here. And it was terrifying. And now, now it's, it's not, not terrifying. terrifying. Look at the guys down. You can see a forklift down there in those holes. Those are the three holes where the water comes out of. That's how big those holes are. It's crazy how much water plows through. And yeah, you can see the water line. I mean, that's probably eight foot, nine, ten feet. I don't know. Yeah, probably. Over the top of this little lip thing. Yeah. And this was just where all the chaos was happening. Now there's just a dead fish trying to <laughs> suntan. Doesn't. Oh. So anyway, we just wanted to show you the non-terrifying version of the dam. It's good to see it not so terrifying, <laughs> people. Yes. It's so non-terrifying that we have people fishing now. Don't step in the yeah, goo. I did. <laughs> you stepped right in the goo. Yay, goo. 
I didn't know this was such a fishing spot. Yeah, please. My hands off sticky for some reason. What'd you touch? I don't know, maybe the, the railing or something. Oh. I don't know. But it's a very sticky dog. And babe, I found the mattress for us. Yay! Okay. <laughs> It says no fish, but I think there's some fish in there. I can smell it. It stinks really bad. <laughs> I don't think they're paying attention to the no fish rule. Ugh. Oh, Oops, you okay? Yes. Hopefully I can't see you like, with my helmet on. You know, you can sit your head down a little bit and see. Um, uh, really? Yeah. Amazing. Okay. Oh, pretty. I want to go swim. Yep, it's pretty out here at night. It'd be pretty if they had like a nice, you had like. Should we put it in jet ski mode? No. <laughs> you don't want to put it in jet ski mode? Come That'd on. That'd be funny if it could do that. That would be awesome if it like could a do that. Hovercraft kind of thing. But no, if they had like little picnic tables like right there, like so you could have a little fun I, I think they used to. Be pretty. I think they did used to, but I think the uh, floods have rushed them yeah. away. Romantic, yeah. Oh, here's one up here. Okay, maybe this is what I was thinking about. This one over uh, here. I mean, like where it's really right there. Yeah, like, well, I think they need to put them up there on the overlook. Yeah. That's where it's really pretty at. Right. So you could have like a nice, really romantic. Yeah. Or even just, you know, family, cool. It's hard to believe the speed limit is 55 down this little backcountry road. It's too fast? Yeah, I mean, it used to be the interstate speed, and now it's the backcountry road speed. <laughs> With houses on here. People live right here. Yes, they have to know to be careful. I guess so. Ooh. Ooh. Ouch. That was a scrape. Ooh. All the traffic. Yes, people on this road will be very happy when that bridge is open again. Because apparently we can drive 55 miles an hour through their neighborhood. Right. I mean, really, this hairpin turn at 55 miles an hour? I don't know. I don't think they mean that you should go that fast on this turn, but... Maybe the straightaways, but yeah, there's not a whole lot of those either. Ooh, his lights are bright. Good. Oh, like turn them up. Wow. Thank you for. <laughs> Rut row. Hi. He's trying to get people like me, but not anymore. The Sonic looks closed. Oh no, I guess they're open. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they look really open, Joe. What are you talking about? They look <laughs> closed. Good lord. <laughs> Fail. Yeah, definitely. Oh god, that's a person in the road. Did you see that? Was what? That was just a person in the wheelchair. We're going right down the median. Oh wow, that's Pitch scary. black. God, she's going to get hit. That's scary. Very scary. It's like, where'd she escape from? Or... I mean, if I was about to turn, I would have whipped into that middle thing like nobody's business. I would have took her out. You going to make her check out your Pokemon friends again? we got to be quiet. People are hunting Pokemon. Oh. oh wow, it's not very crowded tonight. No. Is the Pokemon mania dying out? It might be. Man, last Saturday this place was packed. I think after a while, like, I mean, it's either, yeah, you really well, I knew figure it out or yeah. you just go, like, this is a quick fad. Right, I knew eventually it would die out because, yeah, there's not a whole lot to it, but it was fast. Right. <laughs> last week at this time, there's probably 50 people out here. I mean, they'll be out later, I don't know. I don't know. Well. Oh. Had to get one gotcha. In. I had to get one in tonight. 
All right, I'm going to try to close the vlog without making up some crazy, stupid roar that nobody knows what it means. Like, <laughs> look, they're playing Pokemon. Like Grazing Laria, yeah. My Grazing Laria, whatever that <laughs> Laria. is. All right, we want to thank you all for joining us on our ride tonight. We appreciate you joining us. Kelly, got anything to add? Absolutely. If you like our videos, please like, subscribe, and share a cookie with a friend. Cookie Monster says so. Awesome. Bye. Thanks, y'all. Good night.